Are you overwhelmed with your digital marketing strategies? Then in this video, we're going to discuss five ways to simplify your digital marketing strategies. So let's grow together. Number one, prioritize what is important and forget the rest, at least for now. Start with the marketing tools you already have in place. Determine if your tactics are performing well. If they aren't, don't prioritize them. Use the last year as your baseline for your strategies. So what are things that worked in the last year? Prioritize that strategies in this year also. And what are things didn't work or what all things didn't perform in the last year? Please forget them or don't use that strategies this year also. For example, if you're doing blogging and you have created the contents related um, digital marketing and in one month it got a lot of visitors, a lot of traffic, that means you want to create that kind of uh, blogs, that kind of contents in the future or in coming days. And if you are a content creator on YouTube, you have uh, doing some of the videos and that didn't perform in, uh, in a good way, then don't prioritize them or don't do such kind of videos, uh, such kind of contents in your strategies. Because uh, I'm not talking to the people who have just started in uh, last month or just a couple of months ago. I'm not talking to the people i'm talking to the people who have uh, doing content marketing or digital marketing for past two years or something you have already grown in a bit and uh, yeah i'm talking to you guys okay if a social media channel has a remind statement in terms of engagement consider if it's worth spending more resources to grow it or if your time would be better allocated elsewhere if you determine the tool isn't worth the investment of those resources, shut the account down. Don't let it sit ideal. Number two, create a digital marketing calendar. You know, if you are working alone or you have a team and there are a lot of resources that are available today to manage those things or make it a schedule, there are a lot of platforms that are available. So, uh, for example, if you're working alone or you just have a team, then prioritize the, the schedule or prioritize your calendar. So if you want to create content or if you want to create ad campaigns, please be organized, please be scheduled. So at least for one month that means you will be organized uh, you know what all things you want to do in coming one month or just two months you want to what all things you want to do so that will make you much more efficient so use there are a lot of platforms for, uh, available today so for example if you are a content creator uh, as me according to me i'm a content creator on youtube so what, what what is the thing that i'm using in my daily life to manage the content is notion let me show you let me start screen recording so this is the user interface of notion so you can see here this is my youtube channel's content uh, uh, planners uh, this for this channel actually this is the kanban board you can see uh yeah this is where i put all my ideas what all things what all ideas strike on my mind or my in my brain i just put it here and the content that i have completed the scripting has completed i put it here and the thing that i'm gonna film uh, or the video that i'm gonna film i put it here and editing in progress and the contents that are published so if you if i open this you can see yeah you can uh, set the status here you can set the playlist here and even also date so this is this will be uh, one of the best idea you can do uh, as a content creator so if your brain work like a folder there is one folder and there are so many folders in that folder so if your brain work like uh, like very very what to say uh, very organized and you can go for notion and if your brain work like I have so many ideas here I have so many ideas here I want to pick it from here and I'm gonna pick it from here if you are uh, a brain work like a network then you can go for obsidian so these are the two platforms I personally love I personally suggest you to uh, organize your content or ad campaign what are the things you want to organize it you can uh, go for this a uh, planner for uh, the best planner for you okay moving to number three enlist the help of marketing automation tools 
marketing automation tool can help teams plan and streamline their digital marketing strategies instead of using multiple tools many applications allow you to manage everything in one place including contacts reports email campaigns landing pages blogs social media and more there are many tools available today to manage all the things and you want to use so uh, please don't use uh, different tools for different things if it is possible to uh, go for one tool and that help you uh, for everything then that is the best way and uh, for example for content making or content planning you can use notion or obsidian or for mailing automation you can use mailchimp and there are a lot of platforms that are and i'm gonna do a video on tools for digital marketing so don't worry stay tuned for that so in, in that video, I will tell you how to use the tools and how to automate the things and how can you simplify your strategies. So, okay. Number four, document everything. So this is one of the things that will help you to in future uh, years and all. So uh, business is for long term, right? So if you document everything, what all strategies you are using right now and what all strategies you are going to uh, use in uh, uh, next day or what all things you have uh, done in last days so document everything so uh, like uh, yeah I'm doing the strategies for these all things uh, yeah document it so that will help you to you know organize the things first way and the and you will get an a, a idea about what all things worked in the last year or what all uh, uh, strategies that i have used in last year in particular weeks in particular days you you, you get you get everything which you have documented so that will help you to simplify your uh, strategies everything so I don't know what is happening today. I'm I'm laughing. I'm just uh, cuddling or just everything is so out of focus today. I don't know what's happening. So please don't take it serious. Uh, only concentrate the things you want to get value. You are you are getting value too. And I want to tell that. And if you are getting value from this video, please hit the like button. Number five, delegate. As marketing team face staff reductions and budget cuts in the pandemic, these factors can create added stress. One way for leaders to ensure responsibilities are evenly distributed is to delegate tasks. So, so what all resources you have, you want to focus on that. So if it might be your team, it might be your system. It's, so if you want to grow or if you want to uh, level up you want a system so uh, what all things you have or what all tasks you have just distribute it to the people who are expert in that so if you are working alone what you can do so in which time you are uh, on high so at that time you want to do that if you are a content creator and you want to do how, how can you manage all the things so uh, take one day to uh, make the contents or create the script and take one day to film the videos and take one day to edit the video so in what days you are uh, available or in, in what day you are capable of doing that thing do only that days and if you have a team you can distribute the works to those people who are expert in that that will make them easy and also you very stress relief by delegating marketing managers can have conversations with their reports about what aspects of digital marketing strategies are working and could be improved they can also help ensure the workload is divided equally and also understand that set only the realistic goals don't uh, set a huge goal you want to complete in just one week if the work takes in one month please don't do that if it is realistic so i want to do all this task and i have two days for that yeah if it is uh, okay for that two days please do it otherwise just give much more time to do don't be overwhelmed or don't be stressed out please don't do that 
So these will be the things you can apply in your strategies to simplify your strategies and please be get out of stress. And and the thing, the important thing you want to understand is the strategies or the things work for one company or work organization may not be work for another company. So what all things is working for you, please concentrate on that. Okay. And if you want to know five essential digital marketing strategies for beginners, you can watch the first video. And the future of digital marketing the predictions for 2022, you can watch in the second video. If you want to grow your business, subscribe to my channel. This is me and Elathe, like signing off.